Nu Brivit. I'm Chuck Olenek. I'm a Ukrainian American. And today is Ukrainian Independence Day. 31 years ago, Ukraine, in the course of uh, dealing with a coup that was going on aimed at uh, Gorbachev, broke away, declared its independence, as did most of the other republics in what was the Soviet Union. It's also the six-month anniversary of the invasion of Ukraine by Russia, which is behaving very much like the old Soviet Union. What I've been doing since the course of the war or following the course of the war is I have been collecting pictures and I've been collecting infographics and memes about what is happening because a lot of these day-to-day -day details are going to get lost and I at least want to have a place to deposit them and so I'm using my YouTube channel for that and I don't want those details lost. I want people to remember the ghost of Kiev, whom nobody speaks of anymore, or the uh, woman who handed out sunflower seeds to the Russian invaders and encouraged them to become fertilizer. I want these uh, the heroism of the Ukrainian people to be recorded here. And so that's what I've been doing is just putting things together, shoving them into my laptop, and seeing what comes out. I, again, am deliberately not going to narrate. I'm not going to voice over. I'm not going to include uh, any music in the background because I don't want anything too distracting people looking at the videos. And I want you to Watch the videos. Think about what is going on. If you're so moved, please contact your elected officials. Encourage them to have our government do more to help stop this Russian aggression, which if it goes past Ukraine, it will go to other countries.
when this war began. I said something to various newscasters that interviewed me, and I said this to a number of people that I was thankful that my father or my my mother, my sister, who had had such great joy at Ukraine declaring its independence from the Soviet Union, I was thankful they were not around to see this war take place because, well, quite frankly, I expected this war to be over a while ago. I'm stunned that the war, which should have, shouldn't have lasted six weeks, and many expected wasn't even going to last six days, has lasted six months, and that it's not just simply uh, Ukraine defending itself, it's going on the attack, it's trying to take back Crimea and the Donbass, and is seeking reparations from Russia and showing the world that the Russian military is a bit more of a paper tiger. Now I wish they were seeing this defiance and I wish they were seeing, you know, the way Ukraine is celebrating its Independence Day with a bunch of bombed out and captured Russian tanks and military vehicles in the central square in Kyiv. I hope you, that you will continue to look at my videos and that you'll stick with me on this journey. So, Slava Ukraine!